4.40 p.m. November 16th, San Francisco. Beautiful to be here in San Francisco. Starting to get a little, little nippy in Utah, and man, it's gorgeous in California. It's a beautiful place. Here in the park in front of Grace Cathedral. There's Grace Cathedral right there. Knob Hill, really nice. There's the Masonic Temple. Anyway, um, I'm grateful for Comet Ison for a lot of reasons, but it's making me study astronomy and think about the universe. And so it's just fascinating to think that, you know, we're one of probably several million or billion Earths just in the Milky Way. And uh, where I was studying something where the light emitted from Rigel, which is the largest uh, star in the constellation of Orion, the light emit emitting from uh, Rigel is 13,000 times <clears throat> more or more powerful than the light that's coming out of our sun. And so, man is, oh boy, it's just beautiful up here. Man is pretty puny, if you think about it. And this earth, you know, it is, I was reading some of the top thinkers in the world, how they realize and, you know, postulate that it just, insanity to think that we're, we're the only life in this huge galaxy and uh, galaxies, and it's true. So, I'm grateful for Ison coming through, BP Earth Watch's videos, and I guess a tail, we're, the Earth will be going through the tail of Ison for about seven days in January. So I'm going to keep watching it, thinking big. I'm grateful to be here in California. I'll be out here for probably another few days, maybe a week, then back to Utah, then back to California, and then probably in a safe place in December, January. Even though his on kind of comes around the sun, perihelion, perihelion, I guess, um, that's going to happen right around Thanksgiving time, so I'll be watching that then too. Um, anyway, I'm grateful to be here, a little bit contemplative, and uh, wow, there's the American flag, top of the mark, check that out. So, I invite... Uh, Anybody here in California, if you want to get together, I'll be here for, for a little while, Northern Cal, and back to Utah. I kind of wish California would stay the way it is for the next hundred years, because I'd settle right here in California. It was, uh, you know, constitutionally a great place to be, but it isn't, sadly. Anyway, I'm happy to be a part of this earth, and... Uh, grateful for being able to study astronomy at this point in time.